Hi, beautiful goddesses. It's been a while. Um, I'm I'm working on some videos. I got a new camera, but I need to get a new software to load it off on the computer. So this video is still taken on my phone. I'm still here, guys. Uh, Raven's not. She's currently uh, in New York, uh, Buffalo, New York, helping out a friend. So that's she's not going to be here for um, a few more months. But the purpose of this video is I had a thought. Scary. I was watching some YouTube video, uh, some well, some videos on Facebook actually, and there's a guy named Darman. And he does a lot of inspirational videos, um, the scripts, and they're pretty cool. And I like watching his stuff because he always has a message. But I got to thinking about one of them. Uh, one of the videos I saw earlier was basically you had this skinny girl and this uh, girl who's a little bit chunkier. And the skinny girl was fat shaming her. And that made me think about it, right? So, I'm a chunky girl. I dedicated this video or this uh, channel as a goddess because I think of myself as a goddess and it's a confidence thing right you you think of yourself as beautiful as intelligent you let the words in your head um, dictate who you are and that's how you get shy people insecure people but that's also how you get confident people and I got to thinking about yes Skinny girls get more guys hitting on them. They get more phone numbers, things like that. But why? Okay, so here's my thought. I've had guys stare at me from afar. And these stares are hungry stares, right? This is the T-bone steak that they've been missing their entire lives. They are salivating. They are starving. And they're staring at me. But they don't come talk to me. Well, why not? Simple. Because a guy who loves this can't possibly believe that this is free. I mean, a girl like me has got to be taken, right? They have no chance. So to avoid that heartbreak... They avoid that chat. They avoid, you know, the the you know one-liners and the you know the hit-ons because they're protecting themselves. Because it's girls like me that they really want. The skinny girls, however, I mean, they're a dime a dozen, and they're easy. They like being complimented. They love the attention. So it's so much easier to uh, hit on a skinny girl than it is a chump, chunky girl. I told my husband about this thought. And you know what I said? I said, when you buy a chicken, you want the meat. Well, when the meat's all taken, all that's left is the bones. Guess what we've got, girls? You got the meat, which is taken. So all these guys are left with are the chicken bones, the ones that ain't worth their time, but it's, you know, still got some flavor to it. Think about that. Next time you're downing yourself, next time you're, you believe that you don't look good, you, you know, your, your skinny friend got hit on, but they didn't look at your way. Wow. Maybe it's because they're scared to talk to you. You got a man up. I'm sorry. You got a goddess up. You got to go talk to them. Let them know you're still ready. You're, you're still single. And that way they know have the green light to go. Alright. Comment what you think about that. Uh, if you believe what I'm saying. If you, uh, you think I'm just talking out of my ass. I usually do. <laughs> but yeah. See if it helps you. Guess what? We are beautiful. But there's only a handful of goddesses. And you guys are goddesses. Alright. So, do south.
stay beautiful, stay wonderful, stay confident. Bye, guys.